Okay, so I have a large python underneath my deck. It has wedged itself up against the foundation of the house and is just pretty much not looking to move from where it's at right now, but I have to get this animal out of here. I'm thinking if I can just kind of bother it by touching it like this, it's going to start moving and maybe it will just unstuck itself. Not having a lot of luck with that at this moment. So maybe we should go and start with how I got here in the first place. So this is my pet blood python and it was a nice overcast day. I figured I could take it out on the back deck and get some video or other photos for social media. It's quite an active animal. It's a little bit nervous all the time and I probably should have picked up that maybe me standing over it with the camera was causing it to be a, a little bit more nervous than I should have let it get. But regardless, I was getting some good shots of it and I actually had no idea there was a hole underneath my deck like this that it crawled through. And at this moment, I think I'm gonna be able to have some success. It looks like it's calming down. It's letting me handle it. And I think it's just gonna come right to me and then she decides to go back through the hole. So now I'm standing here trying to keep it from injuring itself. I mean, we are under the deck. There is all sorts of nails and stuff. And she's going back up. So it looks like I'm not going to have a choice but to run around up on top of the deck and see what's going on. And to my surprise, oh, look, she just crawled out. And I probably should have just stood where she went down in the first place and not even bothered running down there. Oh, well, happy ending. Snake is saved, and if you like this video, like and subscribe, and thank you for watching, everybody.